Hello Rangers, my name is Nash and welcome back to Lazy Wars. Today we have all the ninjas part of, well, they added the new Tommy Oliver challenge. First one obviously will be using Tommy himself and then we're going to go with the other teams and yeah, I gave him a bit of a different assist to use. Or more specifically, he is going to be helping uh, Adam. He's got him, he himself, he needs different ones. Probably projectiles that could set up something else because his projectile stun is something else. So block him, dashing impact, and return drop. Yep. And this should give me the breaker. So Falcon dive kick, which I do hit when I get stunned again. And this should be launched into their corner with the ninja strikes to knock them out. Ignore the background, that one had to be changed for today. Something happened to the screen, so I guess we only have a bit of a blue one for today. So explosive escape and vanishing drop. You can tell this is the one with multiple ninjas of the similar type. So the JD team, that's what Adam's going to be using. However, it looks like we had a mirror match, so instead of that, uh, well, I guess we just have to defeat him. He just has to defeat himself. He doesn't fight Tommy. That's a triple twin slicer. Block him and explosive escape. That is a, I mean, seriously. Where's my flanking frog? I did not get it. Get out of that one. There's theirs, and I should be able to land a twin slicer or explosive escape to maybe catch them. There we go. That's a block. Okay, so they, that's theirs, but I still can't do anything. So maybe a vanishing drop here should do something. Yep, explosive escape, activate maximum ninjetti, and sweep them. Now I should be able to land a flanking frog just to start them to finish off. Well, sweep. Okay, now we use Preston. The only two that really were from the, the Ninjetti, well, were the part of the Ninjetti Rangers, were Adam and uh, Tommy, obviously. Now the next ones we have are just part of Ninja Storm and Ninja Steel. Good pick to well, Cam, but he's definitely not Ninja. He's a samurai. He's part of Ninja Storm, but he's he's you, he has said it. He's a samurai, okay? Plus his attacks are called samurai, so stealthy switch, and I get it. Uh, it was still a breaker. So Dragon's Eye. Okay, I should not have dashed in. I end up using Blade Slash, but let's see. That's an explosive escape. It's a vanishing drop. This should be good if I can land and have a good grab, yeah. Just stunned, or while I bound, and now I'll just bring you in again. And now we move on to the Ninja Storm team. This person is, really, they, people need to learn. No, you do not need that many blocks. Poke them once, see where cuts, and now to throw a bunch of ninja, ninja beans their way. I did use it instantly, but that was just to avoid energy reset, so... Oh, okay, that failed. Well, ninja beans! That also failed. Okay, so I'm gonna have to kick them with a server kick, and... See wave cuts once again. Now, you'll be launched. Now, I do need to try and do something, so... Dodge this one, and dodge again. Ninja beans! Throw! Nope. Surfer kicks, and... Beat another see wave cuts. This is just... Yeah, they, they're taunting and they run double blocks. This time, however, they're not one of those that can just easily stop. Twin slice is slow enough so I can just block it if I see it. Dodge that one. Back away again. And see wave cuts. Nope. Okay, Plague. Shock them. Just. I only need to poke them once, so back away. And see wave cuts. To, just to finish off. And this is the final team. Instead of Cameron, we have Blake. We could have picked. I could have picked Ninja, but I think this one might might work better. If I get stunned. I don't even have a strike, so. Yeah, I'm running three breakers, two, two strikes, so. This is not gonna end well. And they have no block, so if you think about it, this is just, they're kind of just a counter, but more like I don't even counter them. So, Grand Slam! Yep! Nope. I get launched instead. I did get Shocking Pinch twice, so I guess I'll just do it again. There we go. And now just the line, just, I just need my energy. If I can land a Pinch of Paralyzer, their health will be gone. Well, goodbye! Okay, dang it, there's a block in the slot. Okay. Shocking Pinch, they should at least still finish off with a bit of a weakened Pinch of Paralyzer. And those are the teams. Most of them, more ninja than they are uh, bulky. Uh, in the sense that ninja are just, you know what he looks like. Ninja strike and dashing impact. This is where you'll be launched with a teleport attack and strike down. Now I just need to recover some energy just to be able to use a meditation. Poke them and a dashing impact. This is, oh, okay, they, if they had energy for a strike I guess they could have used it. Teleport attack failed, they instead used a vanishing drop but I didn't avoid it. There's another explosive escape. And dashing impact. This is where Genji to the rescue is very useful. Doing something like this. And Falcon Dive Kick. Now I should be able to finish off with a Kunai Jutsu if I want to. Right here. Well, I didn't get the dash though. In this sense, I just uh, okay. I don't know if it doesn't let you dash after it, but it didn't. It didn't queue it up, so that's happened. Vanishing drop and flanking frog. 
This is where they can at least maybe escape. Well, there's another Adam uh, mirror match, but Twin Slicer, they didn't block it. So here's the Falcon Lodge. Up you go. It may just be similar, but it's kind of just vanishing drop, but the other way around. Or more like just, yeah, the opposite way and not, not aiming towards the ground. Instead, just going up. Really? Okay. Double one of those for me too, so uh, another Twin Slicer. Vanishing drop. And I guess I'll sweep you right here. It doesn't really matter, it has to be optimal, it's just... I can just avoid Kaya, but it doesn't look like he has her, so... Okay, that did really work. Well, back away, and Twin Slicer. You're gonna be sweeped, that's Eric, so now it's gonna be Kaya. Oh, he's gonna be a super. It's super, and sweep. Okay, let's see, do you strike away with a breaker? There it is. I can't really move this block just yet, I'm still stunned. Can I remove it now? Yep, there we go. And Twin Slicer. They block, and I get stunned. Let's see what they do. This is where I actually might uh, might have actually been a bad idea to do something, but instead, they missed the Twin Slicer. And we're back to Preston. Here's the one that's not a ninja, okay? A giant, okay, the assists aren't related to being ninjas, but meh. This one is a samurai, so why are you here? Just because you're part of the Ninja Rangers doesn't mean you have to be part of this team, though. And I'm more like Ninja Storm Rangers. So, back away. And I can dodge this one. Dragon's Iron. Nope, that's where I should have used the taunt. I had to leave the stealthy switch and all I did was just get struck there. Well, Blade Slash. And, okay, you may have blocked it for there, but I already struck you with a, an attack right after. Back away. I can dodge this one. And dodge this one again. Blade Slash. Strike them again. Now we move on to, once again, the Ninja Storm Rangers. We did just, we did just defeat Cam, but like I said, he's just, he's the odd one out of the few. Poke. Nope. Okay, they're not really doing much, so block you. That's Devin. I guess I have to use the Surfer Kick. They interrupt again. Okay, uh, Falcon Launch. Nope, but I don't have a block, so I need to use a Sea Wave Cut. And it doesn't really reach. Here's another Sea Wave Cut. Up you go. Now, I didn't get a Ninja Beam, so that's gonna be something. Sea Wave Combo, a little too slow. Block him. Here's the Surfer Kick. Now, I do need to use my Surf Slot. It may, it does have Cam in it, but... Uh, okay, avoid this one. And that's... Okay, that didn't really work. Sweep them, poke them away, and see wave cuts. Now they're in the air. And ninja beams, before I get my energy reset. I do have a block in my first slot, but back away. And block you. See wave cuts once again. Up you go. And wind walker. Or wind walk. Well, it's, it's so pretty much just that. Block you. Nope, that's a flanking frog. They can't get their super, so they can't do much damage, but they can just cycle their breakers. No? Okay, ninja beams. Okay, see wave cuts. I'm really not using Tori right at all. Surfer kick. And let's see. So we have a solar cam here. Okay, too many blocks and two strikes, so I guess block here. Well, Prince of Paralyzer. Up you go. Here's a Grand Slam. And Triple Tempest. Now I have only breakers. Okay, that was not a good idea. Back away. I, yeah. That's the way I need to use Presto Freezo, but don't have a, I don't have a strike, so I can't avoid that. Presto Freezo and Shocking Pitch. That's where you can't just use a block. Back away, and Grand Slam! Nope, okay, remove this block. That's another Grand Slam. Of all things it could give, it does this. That's another one, okay. I don't know why you're doing this. Activate this one, Grand Slam! I don't, really don't know why it gave me, uh, it lit that up, but man, eh. Up you go again, and Triple Tempest, you'll be knocked out. Don't think taunting is what you can do. And we enter the final rotation. Okay, this person has the right amount of attack, so they more strike heavy than breaker than my team. Okay, ninja, ninja Strikes into a Dashing Impact, just to interrupt Ranger Slayer. Now back away. I need to use a... I need to land a Genji to the rescue. I get stunned. Okay, that's a launch. Now there should be... something. Block him. Okay, Dashing Impact. Uh, maybe... No, nope. Not happening. This time... How about a Ninja Strikes? This should stun you. And now I can do something like... Back away. Nin dashing Impact into a Genji to the rescue. Dash away. Activate the Super. Into a Falcon Dive Kick. This is most likely... Okay, I need to keep... I need this. Okay, you can dash somewhat after it, but Kunai Jutsu, just to knock you out, because it does quite a lot. Well, at least that happened. It was a bit weird, but we have a Samurai Ranger appearing once again. Seriously, you're not supposed to be here. Falcon Launch! And Twin Slicer. You're still in range, so another Twin Slicer, and that's a triple one. Okay, I'll do it once more, just because. Well, back away. And that's a block. Dash away. Nope, I didn't do anything there. Vanishing drop, you're gonna stop it. You end up just striking right after. Okay. Back away, vanishing drop. 
That's the Jason. Okay, Twin Slicer. I'm not even in range and this is what's happening. Okay, block here. Okay, there we go. Now they struck a block, but, but they, yeah, went their own one. Strike them away, and explosive escape. Activate the super to get a bunch of energy. And leapfrog. You're sweeped into... Well, I guess a flanking frog will do quite a bit. Only it's about 3,000, but it will finish them off. Or more like I will get close enough to their health with a twin slicer. And you're knocked away. Yeah, okay, so both ninja is completed. And here's Ninja. Not many use them. I'm pretty sure this might be the first one. So, Preston versus Ninja. Which one was a better choice? I'd say maybe Preston. In the sense that at least I know how to use him better than Ninja. Block him. Okay, that did not do anything. Have a go grab ya. Anything? Okay, selfie switch. And there's the block. Back away. Block you. And I'm gonna grab you. This will result in a burn. Okay, I didn't properly recover, but Blade Slash, because they used the block too soon. Block you. Well, they used Dracon again. Another Blade Slash. Once again, block you. And, uh, yeah, for once, Preston. Yeah, he's not supposed to be getting these blocks. He's getting way too many. And you let that continue. Up you go. Into a stealthy switch. This should result in something you might not uh, actually like. So, Blade Slash, not even close enough. Block, yeah. That's another Dracon, and why not just get another block? Okay, so, just the Ninja Storm left, which is just Tori a lot. I, okay, if you guys already noticed, Tori's team is, in fact, the entire Ninja Storm squad. Yes, even with the Samurai. Silver Kick, and Sea Wave Guns. This will let me recover some energy to make sure I still have a strike to stun them. Back away, and, okay, I didn't see that in time. They're gonna strike. No? Okay, Ninja Beams, not fast enough. She moved forward in her, instead of throwing them. This person's just using assist. Uh, okay, Surfer Kick. And block here with another scratch. And now you'll be stunned. Okay, oh, looked like it almost missed. Uh, I guess the Surfer Kick. Nope, okay. See my cuts, because I need to get rid of this. Up you go. And back away. I need to use his Ninja Beams. They dodged it. They dodged it. And there's Devin. Okay, see my combo. Now you- okay, seriously. Okay, see my cuts, you are really just spamming those things. Up you go. Each one is shown to be incredibly powerful. Now, we just have to finish off with Blake. And then we'll see about the Corruption Zone, because that is also finished. Grand Slam! Nope, that's a Dragon's Eye. They didn't? No? Okay, that was not something you should have done. Presto Frizo, and you're still in the air for a wild triple tempest. Away you go. Now back away. I can't avoid that one, I just used Presto Frizo, but I didn't get Tori. Uh, okay, so how about I just freeze you with yourself and shocking pinch. I'm just lining up the slots, but I don't think I really need to. So block him, pin to realize him, activate a grand slam. Up you go once again. To probably use a shocking pinch, but block him, and they got it again. I just I don't know why I got block spammed. Same thing happened with Preston. This time, however, uh, uh, they didn't use their first slot. This is why you use it. Middle, the middle slot load for Preston is not that good. So there we go. Those are done. But so is the corruption zone, so let's just open that, start unlocking that one. And let's see. First one, nothing special, no commons, because I've maxed out those. There's barely anything. I, the only thing I could get was if I if I get the character I've already donated. Still nothing really useful. Uh, okay, just 12 epics. I'm at least getting some crystals, but that's about it. And finally, with the second last box, move a Kimberly assist. And let's see. Do you mind giving Merrick? Nope, Adam assist. Of course it gives Adam. I don't even get a new, new epic. I, I still don't have... Ah, you still don't have Tori. Okay, I still don't have these assists. There. See? I don't have Tori or Kaya. It's just weird. But Merrick is at least released. That's all. But yeah. That's Tommy's challenge. However, I'm like the spotlight for Tommy. His matches went too quickly. Yeah, the character might be way too strong if that, hap if that happened. It was only 10 minutes. I'm pretty sure that the other videos are a lot longer, especially since those I have to swap between teams. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure to give a like, comment if there's something you'd like to see, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for not miss anything, and join my Discord, it's in the description. There's a Patreon below that, just follow me there, and your name will appear around this time in the video, and I'll see you on the next, Pandas video! Goodbye!